Dear parents and students of MindStretcher, we understand that several of you have run into technical issues in the first few days of e-learning lessons. We thank you very much for your patience and understanding for transitioning our lessons onto the online platform. Through the first two days of launching e-learning classes, we have figured out and tackled most of the problems that were encountered by parents and students. We have collated them into this short tutorial to guide you through potential problems that you might face while logging onto your online classes using the Zoom platform. So first and foremost, you would have received an email from your MindStretcher centres containing information on how to log onto your e-learning class and how to access class materials online. So please check this email as it's very important. So in the first part of the video, I will address how parents and students can log onto the e-learning classes. I will now click onto my email account. And it just so happens that I'm unable to find the email sent by my stretcher. So the next step is to scroll down into your spam or junk folder and check if, there, if the email is there. So yes, it is here. And I will click on it and regard it as not spam. I will now head onto my inbox account and click onto the email. So as mentioned earlier, this email contains important information regarding on how to log on to your virtual classroom and also how to access your worksheets online. So now, click onto this Zoom link that is provided in the email. And for those that have not downloaded the Zoom app, you actually do not need to download the Zoom application to join the meetings. You can easily enter into the meetings by clicking this button here and then the button called Join from your browser. And it will bring us to this page where we have to fill in our meeting password, which can be found from the MindStretcher email here. This is the demo password for this video, so please refer to your own meeting password in your own email. And under your name, please be reminded to put your student's name and not the parent's name because this will help to facilitate attendance taking. So I will proceed to enter my name and join the meeting. Okay, so now please remember to unmute yourself by clicking this button called Join Audio. And Join Audio by Computer. And also, um, please rem remember to click this button called Start Video so that the teachers can see you. Hey Rachel, welcome to our online class. Thank you for sharing your video. I will now be taking your attendance. Sure, thank you teacher John. So as you can see again, it is important to put your screen name here as the student's name because it is it would help the teacher to take attendance. Thank you teacher John. Now I will proceed to thank leave you. the meeting. Now for students that have already downloaded the Zoom application, Please click on this link again and there will be a pop-up box that prompts you to open the Zoom application and join the meeting through the Zoom application. Okay, so now we'll be moving on to the second part of our video which is how to access our worksheets online. You may refer to the Dropbox link here and click this link. You will then be prompted to enter a password, which you can refer to in this email here. Likewise, this is a demo password, so please refer to your own MindStretcher email for your password. 
Now, all our materials will be uploaded into this Dropbox. And please note that we will only be uploading worksheet materials into Dropbox every Sunday. So for example, if I have a class next Tuesday, the materials will be uploaded by this Sunday. And you will be able to, to find the specific materials in each folder. If you do not have access to your printer at home, please feel free to drop by your respective Mind Stretcher centers to grab hard copies of the worksheets that you need. Lastly, please feel free to reach out to us with any queries and issues that you might have, and we're always very happy to help. And again, we appreciate your patience through this transitioning phase. We hope to make your child's e-learning as smooth as possible, so scroll down to the FAQ section over here and reach out to us in three ways. Firstly, contacting our centres. Secondly, emailing us at elearning at mindstretcher.com. And thirdly, what's epping us at 9852 0870. Please refer to this summary page for more information. Thank you.